Hello everyone! Thank you for watching Ambitious Ayumi channel! Today I will be touring a breakfast buffet at Mitsui Garden Hotel in Gotanda, Tokyo. Breakfast is served at their restaurant called Tanto Tanto The Gardens from 6.30 to 10 a.m. and the price is 1,850 Japanese yen. It is not included in the hotel rate, so if you book with breakfast, they will give you a voucher ticket when you check in. Dining area faces the street and there is a nice outdoor dining space for warmer season. The hotel is located about half hour from Haneda Airport and about 5 minutes or less from Gotanda Station. It is very neatly located. Now let's take a look of what they have. First they had caprese salad, buttered corn, vegetable caponata which was empty here at this moment, four beans salad with tuna, and then they had a little salad bar with mixed greens, bell pepper, daikon radish, cucumber, leaf lettuce and carrots, dressings were caesar and an Asian dressing, and this is how it looks. All the vegetables were nice and fresh and very well chilled. They also have a wood oven and they serve Italian pizzas during lunch and dinner. Around the corner from the warm food, they had a honeycomb with a jar of honey and focaccia that they baked in that wood oven as well as orange and yogurt. This yogurt was plain yogurt and I think it is regular full fat. Also, they had strawberry sauce to top your yogurt. Next to the yogurt area is the cold breakfast items. They had cereal and muesli and a croissant. And they have a toaster oven to warm up your bread. This is from a different angle. So the muesli and cereal, croissant. And they had like a sourdough type of bread and two different types of baguette. It, one was green and one was orange, so I'm assuming that it's like um, spinach and tomato, possibly. And they have butter and strawberry jam. Strawberry jam was the only option. And next to the yogurt, they also had fresh pineapple, which I saw them cutting the actual fruit, so it's nice and fresh. And here's how it looks in that area from a different angle. And these are the breads. They also had an area called live cooking and they were making some omelets. They will put the omelet on top of the um, glass protector once they are done and prosciutto topping is upon request. And here's how it looks. They also had a little jar of truffle oil that you can spray on it too. And here's the warm dishes. They had meat lasagna, bacon, and sausage. These sausages are more of a Japanese style sausage. And potato wedges, grilled mackerel. They had salmon the other day too. And this was a Roman style chicken tomato stew. And right next to it is a poto soup, um, which is a French dish. It's basically a vegetable broth soup. And here's miso soup. The um, ingredient in the miso soup was different each day. They had vegetable day and they also had like shell fish day too. They have white rice, natto, nori seaweed, and some pickles that goes along with the rice. And here's what it looks like. Pickled plum, pickled cucumber, mushroom, vegetable, cod roe, and fish. And they had roasted pork and honey mustard for the pork. And there's a sign here, this is a little hidden secret. Onion soup upon request. And here's the beverage station. Hot coffee, hot water for the tea. And they had a box of assorted tea bags. 
This is me taking a look. This one was Earl Grey. Darjeeling. Chamomile. Rose hip and hibiscus. And they also had some green teas and a few other fruit type of teas. Water is self-serve. They also have sugar and coffee creamer for the coffees and teas. And then right next to it is the cold beverages. Assorted juice, iced coffee and iced teas, milk and tomato juice. You can see the hardworking people behind the counter. All the beverages are self-serve, so you have to pick it up by yourself. But the staff was very helpful and very attentive. And here comes the highlight of the breakfast. They had strawberry rolled cakes. Nice little dessert for a big meal. And one last item before I wrap up the video. They had this big jar of something called veggie water, which looked like infused water with some citrus fruits and cucumbers. And that's a wrap of the buffet tour. I hope you enjoyed. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.